What's up guys, on this episode of Autofocus, we're gonna talk about our resurrected 92 big ass fucking dually, I forgot. I can hate y'all. <laughs> Let's get you started with what's underneath the hood. Well, let's find out, shall we? As soon as I can figure out how to open. So look at there. We took out that old beat up 454. K-Tech provided us a 496 big block LSX with about 616 horsepower and about 636 pounds of torque. I don't know about you, but that gets this dually moving faster than hell. So to dress this big boy up, we got a nice set of front runner kit from All American Billet. Slosh Tubs hooked us up with these wheel tubs that keeps all the moisture and rain and all the dirt and debris out of this fine looking engine compartment that we have now. Ron Davis hooked us up with a way big size radiator to keep everything cool. Even though we're not running AC, well, what do you think, man? We ain't got no top, so who needs AC, right? Um, All American Billet also hooked us up with the reservoir tanks. I mean, you name it under here, I think it looks fine as hell. You could almost eat off this thing. So now that you've seen everything that we've done under here, well, let's see what we did inside the truck. Well, what do you think? It's no longer purple and blue and white. It's all been revamped with new leather interior, new carpet, obviously a new dash. We got another set of uh, classic instrument gauges. Kind of gives it that new school bomber look. Um, an iPad for control for stereo, uh, the AccuAir system. We even went as far as cutting the logo of Crew Cut inside the steering wheel to match the wheels. And let's go a little bit further back. Stereo systems from Wet Sounds and two tens and a whole lot of audio up front. A little bit further back, well, this is where all the magic happens. So the four pump setup that this truck used to have, well, it was dated, it had to go. We called our boys over from Hydroholics to hook us up with a two pump, six dump, whammy setup. He came in, did an excellent job setting up our hard lines for us. Even has power balls on this setup. I mean, it's as good as new, or well, it is new. It's better than the old. This thing rides about as good as a Cadillac now. And look how long this thing is. 20 foot truck, riding like a Cadillac. Why wouldn't you drive this thing every day? So when it came to the paint job, me and Mike lucked out. We didn't have to do too much to it. We did it a couple touch-ups, but all in all, it came out really good. All we did was re-clear some of the parts that needed it, polish and buff the whole truck. Well, it came out pretty awesome. And to set this whole truck down to the ground and making it look even better, we called up old boy Ron Knowles from RK Designs, and he set us up with a one-off set of 19-inch wheels to try to replicate the originals. Well, I think, Ron, you knocked it out of the park on this one. So now that you've seen most of the parts of this truck, well, if you had access to a vehicle like this, wouldn't you drive it? I know I am. Let's go.
not to enjoy. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Thanks for tuning in to watch Crew Cut. Let's go for another try. You ready against the uh, lower it and then raise it up? Oh, God damn! See how fast I went down? <laughs> God, it almost ripped my damn arms off. <laughs> oh, shit, that was good.